Hello, this is Judith and I wanted to film a short video about routines. Um, as you have probably noticed, if you watch a lot of uh, FileFX videos on YouTube or read a lot of FileFX blogs, is that uh, many of FileFX uh, users struggle with how to implement the daily routines in your FileFX because it's a lot of cumbersome work to uh, write your list day after day after day. So I've tried very, very, <laughs> just let's say a lot of uh, different methods and um, I kept forever tweaking and changing the system until last Friday I had a light bulb moment. More about that in a minute. So what have I done in the past to implement my daily routines in my file effects? As you know, I am using my uh, a two pages per day diary, which is here. This is today. Um, what I've done is I've used this uh, pouch page finder by Franklin Covey and I slid a page at the back because here's my weekly list and I put a list here in the back for my daily routines. But the problem was I couldn't uh, uh, mark it up because the try erase markers would um, rub off on the paper and I didn't like that. Um, plus I, w I like to have a very short summarized overview of my week and that's what I put on the back of my weekly compass cards. So didn't work out. Next. Um, I, I tried this one. I tried to, to use post-it notes and just put it in, for example, with a Colido pen and then uh, marking it off with, for example, a friction pen, which I could then erase. However, the post-it lost its stickiness after one or two days, so... No, didn't work out. And, and I didn't like that I had to take it off and then put it again. Uh, on the next page because I also use this as a journal and it meant that I didn't have space for it and that it was in the way and I would take it out and put it here and then it was in the way there and I, I would uh, put it here and so on and so on. So not, uh, not a good solution. Then I found a video on YouTube by Sarah S I believe. She did the comparison between her Dakota file effects and um, the life book. Yeah, well, you know. <laughs> anyway, she had the idea, and I think she said that she had the idea from somebody else again, of using the credit card holder. You have six, six uh, slots. And then placing the routine here and checking it off with a try erase marker. So I did that for a few days, weeks. Um, I put that li uh, the list here behind my page uh, um, page marker, today marker. Um, these are the days: Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday. It, the teardrops by Mother uh, Stewart showed which zone I was in because I changed my zone uh, daily. And on the back I had Saturday and then this card is double folded, uh, Sunday is on the inside. And I had a little small black uh, dry eraser. So it was not too bad, except if I opened my file effects and I wanted to see my work to do list, which is on this side of my daily pages. I couldn't see it because first I had to turn the today marker, then I had to turn my routines. And then I couldn't see my appointments, so back again. So it, it, it bugged me, it bugged me big time. So I thought something else has to be done and there must be another solution. And I actually got the idea by watching one of Purply Life's um, videos uh, where she showed her Muji stamp. And that was the one with the uh, dot where you can or check checkbox and then the lines, four lines. And she uses it on her weekly weekly pages for um, to-dos. I thought a stamp, 
A stamp would be pretty neat if I had a stamp and I could just, you know, stamp whatever I want to do. That would be cool, but where do I find a stamp? So I checked online and I found a website here in Holland. It's called online stamples.nl, uh, uh, which translates as online stamps dot whatever country you're living in because I think it's uh, everywhere and you have stamps in for example a stamp with three or four or six uh, lines and I chose one with four lines this is it see and um, I, I, I could make the text uh, to go on the stamp however I liked it and it was even ready uh, the very next day. So, what I did, I'm going to show you this. Um, I'm going sh to show you this on today's page. Um, I hope I can do this while holding the camera, which is tricky. Well, some sort of. I'm trying to focus here. Um, the brown ink photo is just a little reminder of my daily uh, um, Instagram <laughs> Final Facts ch photo challenge. Anyway, um, well, the top line now goes a bit under the text of the Franklin Coffee inserts under the daily tracker. What I have here is um, I have different routines that I want to do every day, like in, in the morning uh, or evening. And I uh, left out all the routines that are already a habit because it's quite pointless to put something down that you know by heart anyway. Um, so I have here the little checkbox next to it. You can't see it on this side because it went into the colored border. Um, and here. And the neat part is, and it doesn't show here on the page, is that I got to choose the ink of the stamp and I chose purple and you could choose red, green, black, blue and purple. So I thought that was pretty neat. Um, can I? No, it's only getting, getting fuzzier. Anyway, so the idea is now because here I have my daily tracker to just uh, uh, when I make my to-do list for the next day at night to just take out my stamp Stamp the daily routines on the page and ready. And I made this text in uh, in a Word document. And you see that the boxes here are not 100% aligned, but I can't say that it bothers me an awful lot. It just means it saves me lots of time of rewriting this over and over and over again. And I have it here and I just check it off and... It's there the next day, so I can look back, which I couldn't when I used the posted uh, little posted uh, flags, because I couldn't check what I had done the day before. So I wanted to share because to me this was very exciting news. <laughs> bye bye.